So we're going on another adventure, just uh, Arnie and I. We're gonna go to Tangisen and meet up with my coworkers and take some video, some pictures of the mushroom rocks there. Haven't been there before. I think the last time Arnie said he was there was when you were in high school, right? We're gonna try find Shark's Cove and I think Lost Pond. So to get to Tangisen, you pass. Go past uh, to Lover's Point and you just follow this road, it dead ends into Tangisen Beach. So the gang's all here. There's Ev, always me and Ev. Judy, Angel, and Margaret. Oh. Just do not enter. Oh, you know what? Yes. Um, we can actually go. It, it's, a pri it's a private property, but we can actually go too because they, they put the gate here. They Just so the cars don't go, right? Yeah, they don't want so Judy gave us permission. Judy gave us permission to go this way. <laughs> she gave us permission. So we're gonna go. Okay. Oh, Dave. We are living dangerously. Look. Shh. Don't tell. Don't tell. This is it. How many? Seven? I guess. No, yeah, she texted me and said she's not coming anymore. One, two, three, four, five, six of us here. It's beautiful. Okay, we're ready to go. Just the dancers again. You are. He's a dancer. Wearing my gardening hat. There's the mushroom rock. So she said only five minutes. Uh, five minutes? Really? Yeah. I was like, oh, we're not going to hike today. I said, okay, it's not a hike, people. It's more like a swim. Yeah. All right, so we found the mushroom rocks and now we're looking for how to get to the Lost Pond or even Shark's Cove. And we're trying to find where is a clearly marked path on the right side to go in. But we're not sure where it is. So we're gonna just keep on walking. Look how beautiful. Where you at? There you are. There's my girl gang. It's so pretty. It's actually kind of hot though. It's around 4.30 I think. Ooh, getting in a tight spot. Only skinny people can make it this way. Lucky for you if you're skinny. Wait, I'm gonna, oh boy. Careful, I hope this rock don't fall on my head. Oh my goodness, that's so dangerous. <sighs> Little crawl space there. Here she comes. Careful, don't scratch yourself. Only small and skinny people. You should have uh, <laughs> You should have went down the other, what's it called? The, the limbo. A limbo. <laughs> alimbong. Alimbong, alimbong. She's teaching my Tagalog. Alimbong. <laughs> careful, be careful. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> a limbong. I don't know. Still looking for the trail. It's a good thing we came early. It's hard to walk on this the soft sand up there so now we're down here closer to the water where the sand is a more compact we're definitely getting a workout today peace lots of rocks so we googled it because now we have signal we didn't have signal earlier and it said to just keep going all the way to the end of Hilan Beach. We're on Hilan right now. And at the end of Hilan Beach, then we take a right and um, Lost Pond is a short hike from there. So we'll see. Look at this really soft sand and then all these rocks. This is the end of the beach right there. Well, at the end of Hilan Beach is now a trail and we hope to keep hiking and find the lost pond. It's like a butterfly sanctuary here. It's like we're survivors cheering the boonies of Guam. I'm so thirsty. I'm looking for food. Oh yeah, I think this is it. We're at the beach. Maybe we can ask them. Oh, we can ask. Maybe this is Shark Cove. Where are we? We came out and we're at the beach again. So we think we found Shark Cove, but we still don't know where Lost Pond is. The good thing is, no, we're not lost. We know where to go.
Okay, it's like 6.30 now when we're done taking pictures. We didn't get a chance to swim at all, but it was... We didn't swim at all, but we took lots of pictures and we did have a nice, pretty, uh, pretty good long hike trying to find Lost Pond. I think we went as close to Shark's Cove, but then we turned around because it was going to start getting dark. So it's so beautiful. It's fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so true. Say that again, Judy. And then when you have a good company, whatever we do, you stay home or whatever, it's always good. Yeah. <laughs> but it was even nicer because we were out here in the beautiful beach. Guam has beautiful beaches. Always with these ladies. This is my girl gang hiking crew. March motivation. Steps, the dancers. How many steps? You, I think we made like about. No, no, no. I think we made like maybe 5,000 steps today. Just from the hike and taking pictures, and we even climbed that rock. All of us got battle scars from climbing that rock. All of us. Yes, still can see us. Yeah. Ciao. Wow. Adios. Adios. <laughs>